Hey, Turkey Crew. Hey, we're here because EDC is coming up and we wanted to do an entire series about everything you need to know. Yeah, we wanted to give you guys the tips and tricks that we wish we knew before we went to EDC. Yes. Yeah, so we're gonna, today we're gonna start with the number one question, the probably the most important question. What is that? What is that? Yes, it's what to wear. What to wear. And as you can see, we've already started. So, <laughs> stay tuned. All right, so there's many different options that you can choose from to decide what to wear at EDC. But we've kind of come to the conclusion that there's really just like three, me, I'm like three, like there's six. There's, <laughs> there's only like three different types of categories yeah. really um, that we see at EDC a I lot. I mean, there's other stuff. There is some other stuff. Okay. You, it's just a little more sporadic. There's three like heavy things Main that you see a lot of people do. Yeah, and the first one is like themed costumes, okay? Yes. Yeah, like they have all these amazing costumes. Actually, this is one of the best reasons for EDC <laughs> is because you can see so much people watching. They have uh -huh. these amazing, amazing, beautiful costumes. And like one of the, our favorite things to do is like go with our girlfriends and we all dress up in like a theme. Yeah, we pick something like Disney princesses. Or Batman. Justice League. Or flower power. Uh, LED is a really fun. One. And many more. <laughs> um, so there's a lot of options for you out there. Anything you're into, get that theme. Get each one of your friends to dress up like that. Uh, it's super fun. It's so much fun. <laughs> and we like to do like a different theme per day. Mm -hmm. yes. So we have like three different costumes mm -hmm. and we're just like going all out. It's actually part of the fun of yeah. going to EDC is like the preparation of it, <laughs> making your own costumes or buying them or putting them together. Yeah. It's just, it's fun. And it it's just part of the whole experience. I don't know about you, but like I love getting dressed at EDC because <laughs> then it's just like all of us just getting dressed, putting on our makeup and like everything. And the crazy makeup, okay? Yeah, because like, you have to have like rhinestones and all sorts of glitter, glitter. and everything like that. that I mean, it makes it, dude. It makes it. <laughs> okay, so also something that goes along with the costume type themes is full on body paint, okay? There are people out there, they're not actually wearing clothes. Their entire body is covered in paint. It's really cool to see. So that's an option too, if you were like, yeah. And then also the um, nipple tassels. You know, you wear like a little, I don't know, some people wear a thong or underwear, or even a short, and then the nipple tassels and that's it. Now, be honest can't do that that jumping up and down is too much for me but some people can handle it well up to you but that is an option too okay so the next option is obviously onesies and there's a plethora of different onesies out there okay and you can even do themed onesies all right super fun jet well, do you can do all everybody do unicorns yeah, or, what's or another one? Pokemon. Yes, Pokemon. Or Winnie the Pooh. I mean, you Chill. can do themes if you want to do it. Or dinosaurs. Dinosaurs, love the dinosaurs. Oh my gosh. We really want to make our own like turkey themed onesie. That yes. would be sick. Or like a rave turkey, which is like. The rave turkey. It was a peacock. Peacock, yeah. Yeah. So I, I think that would be sick. That would be peacock. so sick. <laughs> Go with a the peacock theme. But yeah. it's nice and warm too. And here's the thing is like, because EDC uh, used to be in June, it was, July or July yeah yeah it was so hot okay it was insane it was literally Ridiculous. it was like literally 105 degrees at night <laughs> you couldn't get enough clothes off okay <laughs> it was insane but now it's in May because they wanted to introduce camping yeah. and so it's like it gets a lot cooler at night and you can get away with wearing one of these yes you can so I, I think it would still work. And even in July, we saw people in onesies. Yeah. I don't know how long that lasted. I don't them, know how long, but <laughs> this is like super comfortable. So yeah. this is like a great option and you can totally wear it on other festivals. Yes. For sure. Okay, so that brings us to the third option, which is regular clothes. So basically anything else you want to wear there, you can. Usually tank top, shorts, 
probably get away with pants since it's earlier in the in the year versus July. So, um, yeah, a lot of people do. They just wear their little jeans, regular shorts, clothes, yeah. whatever's comfortable for you. Yeah. This if you don't want to dress up, that's okay. Yeah. Do you, boo boo? Do you. Something that is a staple at any EDM festival is candy. Candy spelled with a K is jewelry made out of those plastic beads we used to play with when we were kids. People get really creative and make large candy cuffs, rings, or add words to bracelets. So why candy? Candy is a physical representation of the raver philosophy of PLUR. PLUR stands for peace, love, unity, and respect and is the universal principles of rave culture. At a rave, you wear candy so you can trade it with other ravers as a way of spreading PLUR. Okay, so another thing that we love to bring are fanny packs. So just in general, you need like a place to carry your stuff, your phone, your whatever, your hotel key or your key, car keys, whatever. And a fanny pack is awesome because you can still dance your ass off, all right? But you don't have to like watch your stuff. You don't have to drop your backpack on the ground and then look at it because you just have this fanny pack on. But you know, sometimes we do like to carry a water backpack and that's also really great because it like doubles as a backpack and like a water carrying thing. Okay, Turkey Crew, are you guys excited to go to EDC? Are you, or have these tips prepared you about what to wear? Yes. <laughs> Unicorn onesie, what's up? What's up? Anyway, if you love these tips, stay tuned for the rest of our series. We got like a bunch of other tips to prepare you for going to EDC, so stay tuned for that. And if you need help coming up with a whole packing list of things to bring, because there is a lot, actually. A lot of stuff. Yeah. A lot of little things, too. Yeah, remember. exactly. We have a packing list below, check, so check out that link. Yes. And if you haven't already subscribed, so you can stay tuned for all these other videos in this series, hit it. Hit that subscribe button. Hit it hard. Whoa. Okay, till next time, Turkey Crew. We, we out. out. <laughs> okay, Turkey Crew. <laughs> what? What? Oh, yeah. Okay, Turkey Crew. Wait, I don't know what else to say. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Turkey Crew. <laughs> Wait, the whole thing fell off. Oh, no. Again. Okay. Okay, so one of the. Regular outfits. <laughs> so. <laughs> we were just rushing into. Okay, right, so, back. Okay, okay. Okay.